Hello everyone, welcome to the Code Snippet channel. Today I have a very special code byte for you and this is related to the multi selection of photos and videos from photo library. Uh, since iOS 14, uh, Apple has introduced a new uh, framework called Photos UI and now we have the option to select the multiple photos from the photo library also the multiple videos from the photo library before uh, iOS 14 uh, there was no option to select the multiple photos or videos from the photo library so people have to use the uh, third party uh, uh, libraries like ELC image picker controller or something like that so let's dive in Okay, I have created a project already and as you can see I have imported the framework and also I have uh, implemented the code to request the authorization for the photo library. And don't forget to add the permission message in the info p list like you have to uh, use this photo library uses description and then for plus is uh, mandatory otherwise your application will crash so i have added that as well so we have multiple status for the request authorization and if user has authorized already so we will have that status straight away otherwise this method will show the pop-up to the user that he needs to uh, that the application required authorization for the photo library so let's add a function to present the photo library For that, first of all, we have to create PHP configuration. And in the configuration, we need to set uh, selected limit, selection limit. This is the key and we can provide any numbers that we want to limit the selection. For example, right for now we can add four. And then we have to select the filter, like what type of assets we want from the photo library. Uh, let's start with images. And then we will have PHP curve view controller object and we will buy our configuration here. Then dialing it. Uh, let's add the delegate here. Then present this picker. Okay, we're done now for that and uh, Now we need to have a delegate method that is did finish picking. And here we can find the results of our selection. Uh, we can have multiple photos in that result, but right now I have added only one image view to show you the image. So we will grab the first selection from that result
here I am getting the first object from the results and we will see if we can load that object it should be image view UI image sorry okay I think we are good for this if we are able to load that object then we will definitely will go for loading that object need for the compilation now let's see will use the main thread here Sorry for the keyword. Okay, now we will have a if and the selected object is an image. So we will have that result right away. And we can add that uh, to image view. people to dismiss okay great I think we are done now uh, let's try to run this okay for the time being we will allow all photos okay we didn't put that method here my bad sorry for that okay 
so you can see we can select up to four photos here and we can change the limit by setting this property to different value and when i tab on add you can see the first selection is here so that was for the photos the same way we can select the multiple videos as well uh, but first, for, first of all we have to add the video as simulator don't have any videos by default so first of all let's add the video uh, we will drag and drop a video here so you can see the video is now present here and uh, we will cheat the type to video and also we will write a code to get the video here For the videos we will use this presentation So we will have the URL of the video and we can print it here to confirm that we have the valid URL. Okay, let's try to run that code. Okay, you can see uh, the video is right here and we can select like we have only one video so we can select it uh, we can add more videos here to see if the selection is working for that as well and when i tab on add so you can see okay i think we have to select the movie here the type i try again yes now you can see we have the full url of that file which was demo.mp4 so if you can use this to play or to upload on server or whatever functionality we want with this video okay that's all for today i hope you like this video and please don't forget to subscribe the channel and also share this video with your friends See you next time with a new video. Bye.